let's uh, talk about boxing. And uh, Nathan Cleverly says he's going to follow his gut instinct about whether to retire from the sport after losing his world title on Saturday. He was stopped in the fourth round by Russia's Sergei Kovalev in Cardiff on Saturday night. Uh, that was the first time that he's ever been stopped and also his first ever career defeat. Well, I spoke to Nathan a little bit earlier and in an exclusive interview, he began by uh, reflecting on the events of Saturday night. I'm over it now, you know, I, I feel OK. I have my moments where I overanalyze, overthink things and think, oh, what, what could I have done better or should I have not done that? But that's professional sport. I guess you probably rerun the, the, those third and fourth rounds that you had a few times, just thinking what happened, what could you have done differently? It's happened. Um, I've just got to get on with it now, and it's um, it's important that I learn from it, you know. And, and at the end of the day, it's only sport. You know, life goes on, um, and I, I'm, I'm fortunate that I've had a great career, you know. And and um, I lived the dream the last couple of years as a world champion. I'm going to live a normal life for a few weeks now and uh, go on holiday and leave my inclinations guide me. You know, do I want to continue with boxing? Um, if I've got the desire, I'll continue. If I haven't got that desire to be the best, then I'll, I'll, I'll leave the sport. It's a hard way to make a living. You know, you're taking punishment to the brain. Um, it's not a sport where you want to be involved in if your heart is not in it and you're not giving it 100%. Of course, you have changed trainers in the past. Is that something you'd think about doing again? Yeah, most definitely. You know, it's um, a change can be good sometimes. It, it can freshen up an athlete, um, and that's that's definitely an important consideration. Do you think you're going to be miss being world champion? Have you any idea? You know, when you've had that couple of weeks on the beach, where you suddenly think, yeah, this is what it's about. <laughs> most definitely, I'll, I'll certainly miss that feeling of being world champion, but. I have been world champion, I've enjoyed it. I've enjoyed my that chapter in my life. I've lived the dream for the last couple of years as world champion. Uh, and uh, I'm gonna miss it, but if, if I want it back, I'm sure I can go up and get it again. That's Nathan Cleverly, very gracious in defeat, and we do wish him well.